So why am I showing you list queries again? Well, <clears throat> so you might be thinking, well, you know, there's all these, these queries that are built in, but where do they come from? Um, can I create my own? Um, and you can. So let's zoom in on this. So all of the queries we have built in are defined in YAML files. I'd suggest you don't edit those, but you can certainly create new versions of them and use them as inspiration. Um, and each query looks like this. So there's a, whoa, I didn't mean to do that. Um, so it has a name. They're all, they all occur in this sources um, key, and we'll look at a, a bigger file to see the context in a moment. So each one has a name, a description. The query is defined as a simple text string in these YAML files. And you'll notice in here we've got these curly braces that define the replaceable parameters. Uh, underneath there's a parameters definition, so any of the parameters you specify in the query in order for them to be parameters in the function like we saw hostname earlier on they need to be defined somewhere in the query file and it's kind of language agnostic so if you're using Splunk you can put Splunk queries or OData queries uh, it doesn't care about the language it uses as long as it's a string and it has can have like replaceable items in it it will it will work obviously only for the data providers we currently support, but we're adding new ones all the time. Uh, let's look at the context a little bit more. So this is a, a whole query. Um, I don't have time to actually create one and save it, but we can see down at the bottom. Uh, this was our. This is an example of a. The query and it's located in the sources sub key, but we also have a couple of other sub keys of metadata um, and unless you kind of are kind of feeling very confident then I, i'd advise you get you dig into the mystic pi code get or get it from github and copy and paste one so you know this the uh, data environments def define which drivers it works with um, is is um, that's what appears to, as the prefix of the query <clears throat> and we're a bit out of date all our defender queries currently start with mdatp but we'll up, kind of upgrade that soon but we have some backward compatibility problems too um like we don't want everybody's queries in existing notebooks to break so we're leaving that for the moment um one important is the defaults here you can you can specify common parameters that are used in the in each of your queries so you don't have to define them per query these are by default inherited by everything in the sources section so here like every, pretty much everything has start and table name um, and we only have to so in our even though we have multiple parameters in our list ip connections thing most of these are defined globally we only have to define the, the IP address so once you've got your query in a YAML file um, or multiple queries you can have as many queries as you like in a single file and multiple files <clears throat> save them to a folder and you can either set up in config in your mystic pi config file you can add this section and this is a list each dash here is a, a list item you can have as many of those things obviously typically you wouldn't have a mixture of windows and linux paths but or mac paths but um uh you can have as many many of those and it will search uh, all of those folders for queries and load them uh, alternatively you can just specify that query paths to be searched as runtime when you create the query provider um, we specify a path there to, for it to load queries from. So um, if you have any interesting queries, please um, get in touch with us or like submit them to us as pull requests to the Mystic Pi GitHub. We'd be very grateful for 
new and interesting queries from it for any of our um, any of our providers. <laughs>